Um, hi, so this is Ian Roberts, and this is my interview with a professional report. So, a little bit of background about the interview process and the report. Um, I had I had an idea of interviewing my old soccer coach that uh, used to go to UMO. I used to coach at UMO. Um, but then I had then later decided to then go with the guy that I will be volunteering some hours for, for a different class, um, as I felt that this would be a great idea um, to get to know him, get to know the business, but also do this assignment. So before actually getting to know him, and this was the first time I ever met him, I was able to conduct a few interview questions um, regarding the business and all this. Um, I had no idea with what he was going to come out with, and I thought it was a good idea at the time, and it was a great success. It made me think a lot about how I want to view my life and how I want my future to go. Um, it also made me look into what I want to do in the future, if I want to um, work for myself, or if I want to work for someone else, or uh, work for a big organization, I don't know. But it made me think, and um, it made me think back to, and I had written this in the report, that it made me think back to a time when I was uh, a few years ago when I thought it would be a great idea to work, to own a bar uh, myself. Like, not something big, but something something small that can be like a local um, thing for the local people of the area and become a regular sit down, drink, whatever you want to call it. Um, and that made me more interested because I could then go off the top of my head and ask a few more questions uh, regarding the business and all that. Able to teach me about how to run the business, how the financial side works, um, how to get started, um, how he got started, how that really stood out to me, how he got started was when he was uh, a little bit younger. This was five years ago where he just took a leap of faith with uh, some money that he had um, to rent a storefront, converted it into a small coffee shop and from there on built it up to be a to-go breakfast shop and now he, on the side he also has a convenience store under the same name the, and under the same business which works together which means he's been able to expand and create a bigger income for him. Um, for that he was like really detailed in how he did stuff and what the best moves were um, for me if I was to do it too and what he found worked and what didn't work so for me it was a it was a good interview it was a good experience um, I learned a few few good things um, also got to connect with him on a more personal level and uh, build a bit of a relationship with him before actually getting into volunteering so hopefully this will be able to kickstart my volunteering uh, process and I can earn some good experience from it. Thanks.